London may seem a little bit daunting at first, but remember, it's a fabulous city with people from all around the world, and here's a few tips to help you stay safe. If you're out and about, keep any personal belongings out of sight. Don't attract attention to phones, iPods or any other personal belongings. Set your phone to a discreet ringtone and make sure you don't walk about with it on display. If you are taking your laptop out and about, even to college, make sure you stay with it at all times. Don't give anyone an opportunity to get their hands on it. If you have a bag on you, always keep it close by and zipped or fastened up. Make sure your items are property marked with a UV pen. If your stuff gets stolen, it improves your chances of getting it back. Keeping your property safe is one thing, but what's most important is your personal safety. Here are our top tips for keeping yourself safe when out and about. A lot of you are going to be using taxis now and again, but just remember to take a black cab and not an unlicensed taxi. Only ever use London black cabs or pre-booked private hire cars and always make sure the driver has some form of ID. Make a plan. It's always good to know how you're getting to and from your destinations. Check London tube maps and train timetables to make sure you make connections and don't end up getting lost in an unfamiliar part of town. A great website to use is the Transport for London Journey Planner. This allows you to work out your journey with ease and efficiency. Sometimes it's inevitable that you'll be travelling at night, so here's a few ways you can stay safe. Try to avoid travelling alone at night. If you go out, try and get some mates to go with you, or organise it so there are other people you know travelling at the same time. If you can't meet up with anybody to travel with, make sure your friends know where you're going and what time you'll be back. Don't take shortcuts or routes you are not sure of. Dark alleys are not the best places to end up down. Now, I don't know about you, but I hate being stranded in an unfamiliar part of town. So it's important that you've got an Oyster card that you always keep it topped up. Oyster cards allow you to travel on most forms of public transport across London. You can usually buy them from tube stations, news agents and train stations. Also, remember to keep a bit of spare change in your pocket in case you run out or lose your card. This should always be enough for the bus home. We all know how useful mobile phones are, but they're only useful if you keep them charged up. If your phone dies, always make sure you've got some change on you so you can use a public phone box. It's also worth noting that you should store as many useful numbers within your phone as possible. It's unlikely you'll encounter any real problems during your time in London, but don't give criminals an easy ride, take care of yourself and enjoy your time in the big city.